Greetings, we're here in the Google Play Store. File Manager is a very user-friendly, feature-rich software, rated with 4.8 stars. The thing is, the best software is not much of a use if you don't know how to use it. I have used the software for some years already and I will show you exactly how to get the best out of the software in this fantastic video. So let's get started. This is the main screen, let's quickly cover some icons. The main storage is the internal storage. SD card refers to the external SD card. This is the download folder on the main storage. Tap on the left icon to open the shortcuts to the file system. In case you are rooted, you can access and alter the internals of the operating system. So you got a root explorer included, no need for a separate application. Tap on the right side for typical file operations. This is how you create a folder. Now let's create a file and open it. The file manager has an integrated text editor. That's a nice feature. It also comes with an integrated audio and video player. That's awesome! The left icon will select all files and folders. Tap to remove from selection. Use this icon to select all items in between. Copy and paste the file. In contrast to other applications, this file manager supports background file operations. To achieve this, press hide. This is really useful. You will be informed when the operation has been completed. The next feature I like to show you is file and folder compression. Hide it. I hope you like the video so far. Bookmarks are great. You can bookmark a folder and access it later at any time. Here is where you remove bookmarks. Select the bookmark to access the bookmarked folder. The house icon will bring you back to the main window. You can access all files like images, audio, video or documents, no matter where they are located. There are two audio files per folder. The same logic applies to video files. Of course you can do all sorts of file management operations. These folders contain all sorts of documents, like text files, PDF files or doc files. Use apps to access all installed applications. Select the installed app you want to backup. You can later share the APK or use it to reinstall the application. You'll find the APK in the backups folder.
New Files contains all newly created files. Use the open parent command to navigate to the file. Cloud support. The app supports all the important cloud service providers. After creating a Dropbox or whatsoever account, you can save and access your files from anywhere. The application supports various network protocols. Now that's pretty sweet. You can access your smartphone files also from your PC. Press the button to start a service. Open the URL on your PC. access the file on my phone from my PC. That's a cool feature. Let's create a file and drag it directly to the phone. Oh yeah, the file is here, great stuff. To conclude, this application certainly deserves 5 stars. That's it for today. I hope you liked the video. See you next time.